Hi guys, I'm Quinn Marie with Red Carpet Report. We are here at the Choreographer Nominee Reception for the Emmys. We're going to be talking to some of the choreographers and dancers who have brought dance back to television. <laughs> All right. <laughs> uh, congratulations on your nomination. Thank you. How does it feel? Amazing. It really is. It's incredible. You know, it's um, especially when you're it's such a huge fan of. Not even just the, nom the fellow nominees, but just, just all these choreographers and dancers yeah. right now, that are happening right now. They're just yeah. incredible. They just inspire me so much. How does it feel to be a part? You're kind of, uh, you play a pretty important role in bringing dance back into mainstream pop culture, I think. Um, how does that feel? Is that pressure? Or? You know what? It's, um, no, it's, it's, it's incredible. I mean, we just, I just went on this uh, 38 city tour, did 48 shows, and, and every show was sold out, and we sold out some arenas, and, and we kind of sat back and we're like, this is just a dance show. Yeah. You know, this isn't like a, we're not doing a CD, we're not on the radio, yeah. we're doing an album. Like, we're just doing dance, and it was amazing to see the turnout and the, like, the people, and it was just felt like, it felt like a rock concert. Yeah. And that's what we wanted. We wanted it to be a rock concert for dance, and, and that's what it was. And it was, it was just, it was so cool just to think that, you know, people are that interested and in, in that, yeah. that, that love dance that much. And, uh, and it's just, it's just wonderful. It's really cool. cool. Who were some of your uh, dance idols, choreographers growing up? You know what? You you would just, you'd think that my, my idols, dance idols, would be people like that were famous or then you know, the Gene Kelly's in front of stairs, Michael Jackson. But really, the, the my my inspirations came from um, just my fellow competitors and, and my my friends in my dance studios, and they were they were the people who I would look up to and I watch and I would try to get better. And, and so they were my uh, yeah, they were my inspiration. And, uh, growing up, that's this is all you've ever wanted to do. You knew no. you were going to be a dancer. Oh I didn't want to. I, I, you know, I just, I just wrote a book and I just talked about that where being a choreographer never was on my, never on my mind really? ever. No, I, but I, I don't know, but it certainly wasn't that. I, when I was first started doing Dancing with the Stars, I didn't know how to choreograph. I didn't know how to teach. I was really just kind of faking it, you know, faking it until I make it. But I, but I use the expression because I say like, you know, fake it until you become it. Yeah. And it was one of those things where I was doing it, I was learning as I was going, trial by fire, and then I just fell in love with it even more, and, yeah. and it just became something, it just became a part of me, it became something that I obviously love doing, but, um, it, you know, that I am now, so yeah. Thanks for watching, guys. Be sure to hit like if you like this video, and subscribe for more interviews, and let us know who your favorite dancer is.